Good morning, it's Clay at ClayTrader.com. This will be a live trade video where I try to capture some of my trades as they play out live. Market opens up here in about 15 minutes. Real quick, if this is uh, your first time watching one of these videos, when I say live, I mean that this is not a recording where everything's already been recorded, and now I'm coming back and talking about it or doing a voiceover or anything like that. This is me recording the first time I'm seeing the information. So if you're looking for raw thoughts, raw emotions, raw reactions, in other words, if you don't really care about a nicely scripted video and a nicely edited video, but you want a nitty gritty deep dive and not what it's like to be a trader, how day trading can all play out, then this will definitely be a video for you. Um, so that is how it's all set up. Plan on watching Twitter at the opening gates. And I say plan on because right now, I don't know, something I suppose could change, but if you're not familiar with my screen right there, TWTR down 15% right now, had earnings uh, just yesterday on Thursday. And with that context, it's Friday. I wanna start my weekend early. I wanna be done within 30 minutes for sure. Ideally, if I can be done within 15 minutes today, that would be fantastic. So I can just start my weekend. As I've said in many past videos, I do trading not for Rolex watches or Lamborghinis. Now, if you want that stuff, that's cool, go for it. I hope you get it. For me, it's for flexibility, freedom of time. So yeah, if I can start my weekend early after about 15, 30 minutes at most, that would be fantastic. And I, I think Twitter's gonna allow me to get there, but we'll see what happens. But again, market now opens up in about 13 minutes, so I'll see you back at the open. All right, market opens up here in about three minutes and wanna get something mapped out here for Tesla. So on the short side, still awaiting an ideal entry point, but for a quick long-sided trade, watching uh, an upside break of 45. So that's my mentality right now going in is given it's Tesla, or not Tesla, given it's Twitter and it's given it's gap down this much, I'm not sure that it's going to uh, you know, go straight down. I could see it bounce back up, potentially get up through 45. But I put in the word quick because going long on something that's you know down 15% is definitely counter trend, kind of counter environment. So you gotta factor that in by being a little bit more aggressive. Uh, so 45 does look interesting, but then from the short side, like I said, as of right now, I'm just not really seeing anything quite yet that I could really use. So I'm gonna have to let the, the market play out here a little bit. Uh, but from the long side of things, yeah, maybe $45 upside break point. Uh, it's looking like an interesting uh, potential level, but we'll see what happens. Market opens up now in less than two minutes. All right, I'm personally gonna be watching 44.80. I think if it can break through 80, it'll at least go up and test 45. Um, and I'm gonna look to just try to cut in line in front of 45. So I'm not even looking for the 45 break at this point. Although, I, like I said, I do still think 45 has a very real chance at potentially uh, falling, especially if this 48, 44.80 mark can uh, fall, uh, but like I said, I'm not I'm not even gonna wait for that. I'm gonna just, just try to, okay, market just open. Again, watching 44.80. See what it wants to do here. Not a whole lot right now. What in the world? Is my data delayed or is this just not barely doing anything? All right, kind of coming to life. Well, this is a very bizarre open. Well, I may have to be reassessing things here because this is a very, very anti-climatic open here. I am making some alerts in the chat room, so that's why I'm kind of stumbling over my words. And if you hear typing, all right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and just can't. Yeah, I got this one way wrong. Here I was thinking I'm gonna have a, a fantastic, ideally quick opportunity here on Tesla. And this thing is just not, I mean, it's sure it's moving, but not nearly the extent to which I thought it was. So uh, never mind on Twitter for now, unless something changes, but One looks interesting. Might just have to go back to my tried and true Tesla here. 404. Let me get that alert in the chat room. Tesla 404 flush point one minute. So right here you can see 
got that area mapped out. I don't know what just happened right there, but technology, I guess, got the better of me. All right, what is this area? More so about 404, well, really 405. I'd like to see this get up some more, and then I'm gonna revise that to 405. So yeah, let's see if this thing wants to come down. Uh, good, yeah. Want to see it bounce a little bit? Fantastic. Okay. I'm liking 405 that much more now. It's kind of working its way down there. What's Twitter doing? Let me add this on one of my other T T W T R. Yeah, still really not doing much of anything. Yeah, 405, I'm liking. In at 405.30. Let's see if we can get a breakdown to the downside. There we go. See if we can, well, getting pretty jumpy for sure. Let's see if we can get another attempt to move to the downside here. I'm gonna go ahead and cancel that out. Let's see if we can get a little bit, there we go. So took out 100 there. But this thing is oh so jumpy. And we get down through 404. It's kind of pushing down there. There we go. So took out another 100 at 404. I'm gonna take out 50 here because I, I, I'm not quite sure. Does this thing really wanna get continuation or does this thing wanna keep on moving? I mean, it's definitely very, very jumpy. So I'm glad I held on to those 50 shares. We'll see if I can get some more movement to the downside here. There we go. Took out another 25 down there. Let's see if this thing wants to make a move down through. I mean, you gotta think this thing wants to bounce. But we'll see if we can get one more move down through 403. There we go. And all out there, it's for $327, it is 9.35. Five minutes in, $327, especially when I got Twitter oh so wrong, thinking that that thing was gonna be uh, the one that worked out. And you saw everything play out, so I mean, if you're wondering, hey Clay, how does your chat room work? Well, there it was, Tesla 404 flush point, but then I said I made the update, so I edited it right there to the 405 mark, and you saw that all play out in real time. So if you're just one of those people that are interested or, and kind of just wondering, hey, Clay, how does your chat room actually work? Well, there is a, about as real life of an example as you can get everything playing out right there. And with that being said, I'm gonna call it good. So I guess we'll call that the five minute Friday, 500 or $327 in five minutes on a Friday. I am not a greedy savage. I am more than happy with that. Now, if you are interested in getting those alerts that you just saw play out here, then you can do that by going to claytrader.com forward slash team. And really the way to approach that is, 
and we'll use this pricing model, $99 for three months, not per month for three months, which breaks down to $8.25 per week. So the question really just becomes, if I invest the $99, do I believe I can get at least $8.25 per week of value. If you think you can get at least $8.25 per week, then hey, you'll get a great return on your investment by joining the community. And like I said, getting alerts like that. So I get it, everybody's heard of Tesla, but maybe you didn't really see or realize that that, uh, that mark there, that uh, 405 was was actually you know a good level. Because a lot of times people are like, why would I, That I'm not gonna you know pay for that. I, I'm, I'm aware of Tesla, Clay, you alerted Tesla. Everybody knows about Tesla. Yeah, that's true, but I alerted in a very specific uh, you know, detail about Tesla. So that's just one of those things that you should consider and one of the benefits of, you know, being part of a community. So check that out. There's also, I should note, a, no, a mobile app too. So you can, you don't have to stay, change your computer or anything like that. You can, you can keep in touch wherever you may be. And then finally, as far as this video is concerned, if you like these live trade videos, then the quick, easy way to communicate that to me, just hit that like button. Or even if you just type, hey, thanks, Clay, in the comment section, little things like that go a long way and, you know, communicate to me that, you know, this, I'm, I'm, I'm using my time wisely right now because these are not the most easy things to make when you have to think, make alerts, talk out loud and all that all at once. But you know, if, if the interest is there, I'll continue to do that. And like I said, the, the quickest way to do that is to hit that like button or just leave a quick comment down below. Something as simple as thanks, Clay. And then I'd encourage you to also check out the channel as a whole, lots of other live trade videos, a good variety of videos. So if you like what you see, I would love to have you as a subscriber to the channel. So hit that subscribe button. But yeah, if you want to trade alongside me, get my watch list, get the real time alerts like you just saw here. And not to mention surround yourself with a lot of other quality traders then I hope you consider joining my community at claytrader.com forward slash team. Everybody take care, have a great weekend. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too, good, way too good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.